Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So my name is Halima. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you're not new, welcome. Take a seat, relax, grab yourself a cup of tea, get your cup, yourself a glass of wine because today is all about me. It's q and It's I'm going to go deep into myself, okay? I'm going to let loose. I'm going to tell you guys all the secret, every little details about myself, okay? All the gist. Okay, so take a seat, relax, cross your leg because boy, we're going to have fun okay so so yeah lately i've been how um, people have been asking me a lot of questions about myself like they've been dm me like on instagram asking where i come from my pri you know just basically my private life so i thought why not just do a q and a to let you guys you know know about myself because i don't since i started youtubing i've not actually done a q and a before so i thought let me just do it and once and for all instead of ask, you know answering individual people so you know you guys can know me personally okay so um all the questions are on my phone so i'm going to basically go through what is stated on my phone okay so a recent question somebody asked me is um what what's my name like my full name and what does my name means and so on and so forth so i'm just going to go and you know i'm going to go through each questions and ask you know it's answer you guys okay so um my name is halima Tu, and my surname is bonsu okay so halima Tu means um god's child it's an islamic name and um, it means somebody who is kind and also alima alima is somebody that um in islam is just like a mother who fed one of the prophets muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam i don't think you guys know um, who, if you know who Muhammad is, fine. If you don't, then obviously it's one of the prophets like Jesus Christ. So yeah, so it's, that's the meaning of my name. Okay, okay. So Bonsu is um, is like a Ghanaian um, traditional name. It's a Shanti name. So yeah. So and somebody asked me another question. They asked me is where do I come from? And um, where do I come from? Oh my God, this is quite an interesting story. Um, basically, my parents are from Ghana. Um, however, I was born in UK and so I classify myself as Ghanaian British but there's nothing like Ghanaian British right because one time I remember there was this lady who um I she asked me where I come from and I said to her I'm a Ghanaian British she's like there's nothing like a Ghanaian British and this woman literally spent an hour lecturing me that um there's nothing like a Ghanaian British that is I sh if I am a Ghanaian, I might as well just say I'm a Ghanaian or British or whatever. But yes, yeah, she spent hours, literally, she spent hours lecturing me. Stop, she stopped, literally stopped what she was doing just to tell me that, hey, there's nothing like a Ghanaian British. <laughs> you know, it's either you're a Ghanaian or you're not a Ghanaian. But yeah, so yeah, that's where I come from. So I should say I'm a Ghanaian. Ghanaian British. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, so that's what it is. So yeah um who am i and um also somebody asks uh, where i grew up um i grew up in london um south london that's where i grew up and uh... okay so what do i somebody asks me what do i do for a living so i'm a staff nurse i'm a registered staff nurse okay and i work in a &E. i'm a qualified a and &E staff nurse okay i'm obviously i'm not going to disclose where i work which hospital but I am a registered staff nurse and I'm an entrepreneur as well. I um, have my own business. I sell human hair and waist trainers and things like that. So if you guys are interested in buying human hair, check out. I'll leave the link in the description box below um, where you can buy good quality human hair and so on. Okay, so back to the questions, okay? And somebody recently asked me, um, am I dating? <laughs> are you single? <laughs> are you married and all that question so to let you guys know i'm not married and i'm not dating and i am single uh, it's a long story cut short i don't really want to go into the reason why i'm single and um, if because it's really intense and it's quite complex and it's really emotional if i said i'm going to go into it it's going to really bring a lot of tears to my eyes so um this this specific person that asked the question yes i am single now and you know i wasn't before but it wasn't my choice to be a single person so yeah so that's that's your answer to your question I am single okay 
Um, so basically, and then the next question somebody asks me is like, what is your favorite food? What's my favorite food? Oh my God, if you know me very well, you know what I like. So today I'm gonna tell you guys what is my favorite food. So my favorite food is salad. I love a good salad, oh my God. Tuna salad, egg salad, chicken salad, trust me that's what i like anything that has got greens and vegetables and you know you name it anything that has got salad on it or got veggie i'm up for it i love healthy food i love healthy eating and salad is my favorite food okay so you guys now know what i like to eat <laughs> okay so um and somebody asks me what do i do in my spare time what do i do in my spare time um Really, I don't really have a lot of hobbies, but um, I tend to, like, I like to sleep whenever I'm, like, less busy or when I'm not working or whatever. I like, that's my hobby. I like to have a good nap and a good sleep. Um, I like to exercise. I like to go to the gym. <laughs> I like to go to the gym. Sorry, I'm laughing because I've got my friend down here and he's like watching me and I feel really nervous talking about myself to the to the camera. Okay. So I like to go to the gym um to exercise and I like reading novels and things like that. That's a really it's some time going out if I get the chance to go out. But um yeah, apart from that, that's it really. There's not much to me guys and some somebody asked me what uh, entertain me like what kind of uh, music do I listen to Um I'm not really I'm a type of person I'm, very, I'm really flexible okay I like I like anything that will just bring the best out of me so music wise I love R&B so um, you know Afrobeat um, so anything that would get me dancing really just to get me going that's it not nothing specific so yeah anything anything really get me going um what is your favorite um artist my favorite artist will probably be um rihanna yeah rihanna beyonce um i like i like odell definitely i love her voice she's got that very strong powerful voice um who else mary j blige that's my next artist that i love i love listening to her music and whitney houston who doesn't love whitney houston oh my gosh she's just the best there so rest in peace okay so guys so the next question is some, somebody asked me um what do you drink like what kind of drinks you normally like drinking um god i'm a type of person i don't i don't drink heavy i don't really drink let's i spare say i'm not gonna sit here and be a pretend you know angel i just love being healthy and um i just love um, healthy food and healthy drinks like my favorite drink would probably be orange juice i love orange juice it's my favorite drink um and, and that's it and then somebody asked me because i'm a youtuber and i do a lot of makeup tutorials and makeup reviews and all that stuff somebody asked me what is your favorite uh, makeup brand my favorite makeup brand so far okay since i started this youtubing i've not actually tried um I've tried a quite a few um, like high-end brands, okay. But the latest one that I did try that I love so much, oh my god, is Fenty. You, I think you guys can guess that already, right? Exactly, Fenty by Rihanna. This foundation that I've got on now is actually Fenty and foundation, and honestly, I'm addicted. When I said addicted, I'm addicted to Fenty products now. I think I'm gonna spend all my money. Rihanna can just have all my money. She just literally, she's got me now. I'm hooked. I'm addicted to her products because her foundations and everything else is just like spot on. Okay, so that's that's definitely you know you guys are getting to know me now you want to know me you want to hear all the gist everything about me so i'm telling you guys okay um somebody asks um so what makes you happy what makes me happy um i'm a flexible person i love to be around good people good um energy positive people people that um i can influence and they can influence me influence me in a positive way okay so yeah i love being around good people and also somebody who has loads of jokes in their bags you got to make me happy when i'm around you i don't like boring people 
you got to make me laugh if you don't make me laugh i ain't coming to your house <laughs> basically it's that that's as simple as that okay so yeah definitely i love good people i love good spirit you know good energy positive people hard-working people and so on and so forth so yeah so somebody said to me i should describe myself in three words oh wow okay this is quite intense oh my god the question side so many questions i don't even know where where to end so how do i describe myself in three in three sentence uh, in three words basically well i'm hard working i'm very enthusiastic um very positive okay um three words i'm gonna go on and on <laughs> I'm very passionate in what I do and um, I just I just love people I love being around good people I love being around people I'm a caring person as well I have a very caring nature to me so yeah it's more than three words now okay but I'm just giving you guys more okay um, and somebody asked me um, in what do you see yourself in 10 years time well 10 years from now where do I see myself well I pray um, to be married, settled, and you know, kids and happy home and successful more than I am. And hopefully, my YouTube channel will be more grown with you know, like million subscribers and you know, and so on and so forth. So, yeah, um, that's what I'm aiming for. And just be healthy. All, all the things that I mentioned are just materialistic things, but the main aspect of it is to be healthy, to be happy, and still to be still, you know, go keep going and God prays on me and so on and so forth. Yeah, um, that's that's basically to the question. Um, where do I see myself in ten years? Yeah, basically just to be healthy and be happy and you know to be successful. I went to Norwood Girls. Yeah, if you've been to Norwood Girls and you're you're subscribed to my channel, raise your hands up. <laughs> so yeah, I went to Norwood Girls, and um, yeah, it was a good school. Definitely, London was my home. I love London. London literally was everything. It's, it's a vibrant city. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. And somebody also asked me what's my first job. So my first job when I left school, I started working. I had my job first job in Marks and Spencer in Brixton yeah definitely I was a sales advisor and um, so I was there for a little while whilst I was going to college and um, so basically completed my college while I was there then when, and I'm just I'm, I aim to and obviously not go so deep into this um, Q&A um, obviously I can't answer all the questions I've got loads of questions that the people have sent to me by um, my Instagram DM so I can't really answer all everything so I'm just gonna basically answer the most important ones and then um, the, the last question I'm gonna throw in for you guys is basically where do you where do you want to go where, where do you want to go for holiday or where you've been holiday um, Normally I like to go home, like to go to go to Ghana for a break. Um, but this year specifically, I wanted to travel all around. I wanted to travel, like to to go to different countries, like you know, just to see the world. I wanted to go to Barbados. I want to go to um, um, North um, Amsterdam. I've never been to Amsterdam before. I remember when I was in uni, my friends were all going to Amsterdam, and I really wanted to go because I, but I didn't get because my work, my, my, course was mainly like placement and stuff like that. So I didn't actually the time they were going, they actually get the time to go with them. So I really feel bad. And I wanted to do that this year. I wanted to travel. Wanted to wanted to go to Amsterdam, like I said, and just basically just travel all around the world. Then guess what happened our sister covid decided to come and just destroy and restrict everybody and restrict my movement and stop me from achieving what i wanted to achieve but nevertheless hopefully next year will be another year will be a better year for all of us to do what we plan to do and travel and so on and so forth so yeah so if go if all goes well i'm definitely aiming to travel next year I'll travel all around and just enjoy and um live my best 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 life and just be happy so so yeah guys this is all the questions that people there's too many questions honestly if i show you the questions there's too many but um i can't answer otherwise i'll be going on and on and on in this tutorial this tutorial 
<laughs> this q a will take too long so i'm gonna wrap up now so i guess now you guys know a bit about me who i am where i come from what i aim to do and what makes me happy and things like that so i hope you guys enjoy this q a question if you do enjoy it you want to follow me and learn more about me all you need to do hit that subscribe button where it says subscribe literally just hit it but don't break your phone though like don't break your phone just hit, hit it gently subscribe to my channel okay um and we can be personal and comment like share my video among your friends okay and spread the words and tell them Alima who Alima is and so on and so forth so yeah guys i'm so grateful to have you guys so thank you so much for watching and 